allow me align myself totally with the prayers of the Deputy Speaker as far as this petition is concerned. I also want to express my heartfelt condolences to the families and to the lives that were lost or that have been lost as a result of the nefarious activities of the Special Anti-Robbery Squad, also known as, as SARS. I also want to commend our teaming youth for their peaceful protests that have been um, going on right now in various states of the Federation. Indeed, Mr. Speaker, honorable colleagues, the activities of SARS, even though the intent of um, the unit being brought to life was to maintain security, have actually been taken the other way around. The extrajudicial killings, the various activities of SARS really have become something that we all need to watch out for. It has gone beyond just calling hotlines, it's gone beyond having reforms. The National Assembly, as the Deputy Speaker rightly said, really need to look into it. The IG of police seriously must consider we are working for the people. If the unit we've set up is not working for the people, and the people are calling for it to be disbanded, then let us do what they are saying. Because the truth is, you can't just arrest people along the road because of the hair they wear, or they are carrying laptops. That is not to say we do not have bad people. But yes, because of the lack of training on how to deal civilly with people, we've now come to what we have, what SAS is today. So I totally are, am in alignment with what um, the prayers of the Deputy Speaker, and I feel that we should do that expeditiously. Thank you very much, sir.